Welcome to In Business, a series produced by Good Morning Belfast for the Belfast Area Chamber of Commerce. Meet business people, nonprofit leaders, and others who work to make Belfast and Waldo County prosperous and vibrant. The Chamber of Commerce provides networking and training for businesses, strategies for new economic development, and promotions for attracting visitors to the Belfast area. Find out what's happening in business across Belfast and Waldo County and meet the people who are making it happen. Hello, I'm Steve Ryan, the director of the uh, Belfast Area Chamber of Commerce, and I am dressed a little bit more nicely than usual because I am here with my guest, who is a uh, fashion retailer, one of the uh, several fashion stores on Main Street in Belfast, Dee Bielenberg. Welcome, Dee. Thank you, Steve. Dee, you have two stores right on Main Street in Belfast, and you have a store, I believe, in, Bel in Bangor. And I'd love it if you could start by having us just tell you about, uh, tell us about the stores and okay. uh, what you're doing. Um, City Drawers opened at 105 Main Street in 2011. It was kind of a big banner year. There were a bunch of stores that opened that year. It was a lot of ribbon cutting. It was. It was fun. I guess maybe after the recession, that's mm -hmm. sort of what mm -hmm. got things going. And um, uh, city drawers is a little play on words. Um, drawers meaning like underwear. Um, but it's, uh, it's evolved into a, a bra shop. That's primarily what we sell. Um, and we offer fitting services too. So we've been here for, we've had our eighth summer. And, um, and then Man on Main was an expansion um, selling men's clothing. Uh, in 2014. And very nice things, very unique things at times? Um, well, they're certainly not one of a kind kind of things, mm -hmm. but um, unique, unique for Belfast, useful, needed for Belfast. Mm -hmm. um, and certainly with um, the lingerie and bras, definitely was um, a new thing we were bringing to the area. Um, and something that there's very few places you can get in the state um, and many many women need our services. Excellent. How did you get into the clothing and fashion business and how did you come to open these stores? The, um, well my background is in fashion that's what my degree is in and my career prior was mostly where fashion intersected with technology um, so I never anticipated owning a retail shop, but that is what happened. <laughs> Great. And uh, you also have a site in Bangor. Bangor opened almost exactly a year ago. Okay. How's that going? It's, it's good. We're on a block that's in um, some transition with um, road work and sidewalks being recreated, but it's going to be beautiful in about a month um, with new new sidewalks and benches and yeah it's going to be the best block in town. Well that is terrific. Uh, what uh, are you planning for your stores, or your retail operation? Do you have any place that you want to head as you, the business settles in and grows? Well we're kind of um, limited with the size um, but uh, we certainly can always have more customers and with Anything in the fashion business, um, although I don't see ourselves as trendsetters, um, there's always innovation in fabric technology and things like that. So mm -hmm. I'm always on the lookout for styles that are going to accommodate what women are looking for. Um, and in the men's business, the store, we have mostly casual men's clothing, but um, we also do a rental formal wear business, mm -hmm. um, which is big in May, but we help men all the time, whether it's for an interview or uh, for a wedding they need to go to. Um, and then we also do custom men's clothing, um, shirts and suits. And um, so we can help men in lots of different ways when they come in the door. Very nice. All right, we uh, just have a, a little bit of time left. What closing thoughts would you like to offer? What should we know about oh. you and your stores? Um, you had asked prior off camera about um, being online and yes we obviously have websites and Facebook pages and things like that but um, we have in the last couple months started um, with um, shopping online at City Drawers 
So we don't have everything in the store. We always love to hear from you. So if you don't see what you're looking for online, you can certainly call us and we can help you. Um, and then with the men's business, we are relaunching a new website with that pretty soon, too. Oh, great. So, okay. Yeah. Look forward to it. Great. All right, Dee, thank you for joining us. Thank you. Us. All right. The Chamber of Commerce provides networking and training for businesses, strategies for new economic development, and promotions for attracting visitors to the Belfast area.